why have you brought me here? Why why would you not want to get up at six in the morning to go fly drones at golden hour around a castle in Runcorn? Who who would say no to such an opportunity? I know nobody who would say no to such an opportunity. I... Evident by the fact that you said yes and here we are. Well, I can't argue with that. Which transport dance drone? <laughs> we need this. And and my drone. I've, I've forgotten I had it because yeah. it was in my pocket. Yeah, yeah, and, and I'm also wearing ladies' gloves. Mine was cheaper, I win. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so here we are. Um, Dan's already taken his drone off. So he initially took us to the water tower um, in the middle of an estate, which is where we were just then. But now we're actually at Halton Castle. And his drone has gone on a massive trek, so I'm gonna set mine up now. Okay, so flight one was a success. It's one and done over here. Well, it's one and done. I'm one and done because I only have one battery. What? That is, that's, I got three bits to my charger as opposed to your one cable. So overall, Dan, after looking at my drone and looking at your drone, I would say they're which pretty is equal. More, which is more convenient? Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Who cares about convenience in filmmaking? No one cares about convenience in filmmaking. Breakfast buffet, three ninety nine. That's what I'm talking about. Oh baby. I do like a harvest of breakfast as well. Teamwork makes the dream work. Oh, Beth, I love you for that. So we've had some breakfast, had a coffee. We've decided we still have coffee. You can actually take your bike. We've, we've decided we're going to go and check out another castle. I'm thinking Beast, and he's thinking Conway. We can't make a decision yet. We'll we'll have a nosy. We're going to rock paper scissors for it. <laughs> All right, ready? Rock paper scissors. Wild Beast and is. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we've arrived at Beasting Castle, but Dan got his drone taken off him. Uh, because they have special rules. Luckily though, the Mavic Air was small enough to fit in my pocket and they didn't notice. So I got through the door, no issue. So I suppose score one point for, we'll bring points up at the bottom. Score one point for the Mavic for being portable enough not to be taken off me when we're trying on. Do I get a point from the first flight where I had better battery life and was up in the air for like way longer? Yeah, yeah okay, that's a, that's a point for the unique. Okay. A point each. Yeah. yeah. Nice uh, hat. Thank you. It was a scarf. <laughs> now it's a hat. It could be a ninja mask too. Brilliant. This is stunning. It's got an absolute stunning view and it really gives you a good sense of how flat Cheshire really is. brought me. You said to drive up this road. We just stopped in a coffee shop 
to re tea room. Come on, behave now. The tea room. We stopped in the tea room. Uh, and now we're going to go and we've been advised we're going to go and head up to the Pheasant Inn on the top of the hill for sunset. Okay, so we're getting to the end of the day. We've had quite a successful day. I've quite enjoyed it. Great. It's been very enjoyable. Yeah. Lots of flying, lots of filming, lots of photoing. We're now at sunset. We're going to go and take the drones out last. Last point. Last time. Last bit. For Just catch that sunlight. Yeah, exactly. So, without further ado. So overall, it's been quite a successful day. Dan is still dismembering his drone whilst mine is whilst mine is uh, packed away. Ten minutes before his is, I'm just, just pointing that out. So that should be another point for the Mavic. Anything you want to add? Good day, good fun, good drones. It's all, it's all in the name of good footage. Indeed. Hopefully. And that's the end of this episode.